we go. Rooney, he's 10 and 10, but he's been on fire lately. He's a Division Three transfer from Cincinnati, Ohio, Anderson High School. And your final bout, 197 pounds for West Virginia, Kyle Rooney. For Redboro, Sean Fandoni. Kyle Rooney, a Division Three Heidelberg transfer. He's 10 and 10, but he wins this match. He's the number one seed in EW. So if Rooney wins this, he is your number one seed. No Connor. Can we see him? Or did you hide him? Nobody has for a while. So Rooney beat Shooth of Ohio University last week. He takes a shot. Rooney trying to run around, trying to get it. Rooney's able to get this one to be huge. Can get the take on here. Limp leg there, a little noodle leg by Fandoni. Now he might try to split the middle. They're battling here. Fandoni's locked in the crotch. Fandoni, he's got the bottom leg hooked. Swimming his head, getting his shoulder out. Fandoni steps over. Boot in right away. Fandoni rides boots high. So Fandoni's able to step over, get the takedown. Yep, his older brother. He's over there on the bench. It's the guy who wrapped in the sweater. Why don't we just ask for him? <laughs> so Fandoni riding on top on Rooney. So, Fendoni with 44 seconds dry time. It's 108 left in the first period. 26 6, fighting Scots. Rooney trying to get up on the board. I'm going to go grab these guys over here. Yep, grab the dudes. Okay. Yeah, uh, I want to get Jared. Yep. He's got a bag of ice. You know what? Let's get a Donnie. So you want to grab Donnie? Jones? Yep. Yep. Hold on. Ira. Donnie Jones. So Fendoni's remains on top. There's 33 seconds left. It's Frank and Rooney over. Getting the near falls. Eighteen seconds left. Looks like he's gonna get the fall allotment of points. It's gonna be 5-0 after the first period, it looks like. Short time, Rooney. So Fendoni. Coming out with a strong start, something maybe he needs, and he's going to be over the top. So it's going to be three near fall. Sean Fendoni looking good. In one period, Fendoni with the five zero lead. Can do that thing again? Sure. Yeah. Fendoni chooses neutral, or excuse me, chooses down. So Fendoni's going to go down. He's got a minute 51 ride time. He's up 5 0 over Kyle. So Rooney looking to ride here. Hips around the mat. Fedoni looking to dig the foot out. Now Rooney's going to be looking for near falls. Fendoni's from New Hampshire. Rooney riding tough on top, man. Edinburgh has, or, uh, Virginia has a 
125. They won the first two, right? Yep. 105 left in the second period. Rooney got to get a turn here. He's brought the ride time down below a minute. Mendoni head on the mat. Cranking power half. Rooney is. Boots out now. Puts it back in. He's riding Fendoni hard. Cranking it. Cranking power half. Now he's got double boots in. Trying to flatten Fendoni out. 25 seconds up in the second. Rooney gonna ride the period, it looks like, with 15 seconds left. Fendoni made no real attempt to come off the mat. So the period's gonna end. 5 0 still. Fendoni. Fendoni. Toes down. Rooney's gonna choose neutral to go to third. Rides the period, he's still down 5-0, unable to turn. Fendoni, Fendoni went in that scramble and has a nice turn at the beginning. He's able to set on a 5-0 lead right now. Twenty-three left. Rooney's got to get something going. Fendoni, not been warned for stalling. He can hang out. He can run. He can afford to run. He can afford to give up stall calls. Quite frankly. Let's go! One oh two left. Rooney not really able to get anything going. Fendoni doing a nice job of keeping the tempo with this double. There's a nice low double. Fendoni noodle legs him. And looking to come through here. Fendoni locked in the crotch, puts the center. Fendoni doing a nice job defending. Now Rooney isolates to a single. And Doni doing a great job of defending here. 25 seconds left. Rooney's gonna need a five pointer in the next 25 seconds to put this one into overtime. He's gonna have to pin him to win. Savage was. Go! And it's going to be a 5 0 win. Fendoni, the proverbial monkey wrench, has been thrown into the seating for the EWLs. And it's going to be a 29 6 win for the Fighting Scots. Both teams are going to be at the EWLs.